that it will emerge out here now. So let, let's, okay, these are, these are the things given. This is how much radius R2. And, and let this radius be R1. Fine, so these are the some data which is available. So let me take this is R radius, this is R2. Let this level of liquid be H. <clears throat> if the height of the fluid is equal to H. Okay, what all the question given, I just made a very uh, neat diagram. Let, let's get into it. So now, now, what is asking? Find the static pressure of the fluid in the clearance as a function of distance. R. What do you mean by clearance? This is the clearance. Huh? This will be narrow, even here also I'm showing big gap. This, this Y will be very small. Is asking what is the pressure at this particular point? Okay, what will happen to, what is the state of liquid here? Liquid here will be at rest. What about liquid here? Liquid will be moving. And, and by the time it comes here, it will have velocity v1 so here it will have velocity v1 here it will have velocity v and what about the liquid here will be at rest okay i'll, I'll show it there's everything will be at rest now you draw a small different layers of liquid So there's a one thing. No, uh, what, what is the, th this radius is how much R1? This radius is R1. This radius is R. This radius is R2. So now, what is this? Velocity of this layer will be V1. Velocity of this layer will be V. What about this? This will be a test. What is this? This is the layer of the liquids where in the clearance. Bottom view of clearance. Hmm. Say one thing, sir, uh, sir we, are, we are not getting any idea what to do problem. So tell me, uh, will, will liquid will emerge out here? Liquid will come out, comes out, no? Flowing liquid. Now, what do you say liquid here at rest? So this, this everything liquid will be at rest. The moment what happens, the liquid here open starts flowing out. So the liquid which is at rest open, the moment it arrives here, it starts flowing. Will I agree this? By the time it arrives here, will I have speed V1? Somewhere in between, we'll have speed R. At a distance, radial distance R, it'll have a speed V. Okay, this much is what as a teacher I'm, I'm explaining. Okay, now how to write the equation of continuity. So let this distance be Y, or, or if you want to write capital D. Why again you think a variable? 
let me write capital B. Now, what is the equation of continuity? The equation of continuity will be, uh, what is the thickness of layer D? Then, then area you are going to be, the liquid will be of like this, no? And it, its speed will have V. So what is this? This is the surface area, no? So the equation of continuity will be Q1 is equal to Q2 is equal to Q. So what is the Q1? 2 pi R1 into D is the area into V1. 2 pi R2 into D into V2. 2 pi R into D into V. What is capital D? Capital D is the thickness. So everything will cancel out V1 R1 equal to V2 R2 is equal to Vr. There's a one equation of continuity. Of course, V2 will be at rest. Okay, now let, shall we write the equation? Uh, what is the pressure at one? Everywhere here, this is there, no? Pressure at one should be P naught. Because the wall will be exposed to atmosphere. I think uh, uh, this diagram is what I'm explaining better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Will, will, will fall like this. So what is the pressure of the liquid at this particular point? Should be P naught, no? Here P naught. Here somewhere the pressure we don't know. The pressure here we know it. How much? Rho GH. P naught plus rho GH. Okay, let's write the equation of continuity between these two points. So P naught plus rho B1 square by 2 is equal to pressure inside P plus rho V square by 2. Why, why there is no potential energy? Because these two points are on same horizontal line. Same horizontal line I, I picked up. No, what is P is equal to? Pressure this point, how to calculate? So I'll, I'll, I'll write one more equation. P is equal to P naught plus rho V1 square by 2. What is our question? Find the static pressure. This expression for P is needed. V1, V, what happened? What we have assumed it <coughs> has to be replaced here. Shall we apply now between 1 and 2, the Bernoulli's theorem? Uh, pressure at P1 plus rho V1 square by 2. Will I agree? P2 plus rho V2 square by 2. We know what is V2. The liquid will be at rest. No? Any reason? The point 2 will come here. This is a point 1. I'll indicate those points clearly. We'll agree this. What is the state of liquid in this in this region? This will be a test. So what is V2? V2 should be zero. R write at many places. Okay, let's write now. So pressure here is P1, P1 plus rho v1 square by 2. What is p2? p2 should be p0 plus rho gh. Pressure at 1 is p0, sorry. This will be 0. So therefore, what is v1 equal to? Root of 2gh. That value, I'll substitute here. Then how to replace How to replace V1 and I'll use this equation. Let's take all this equation one, two, three. Let me admit all the things now. Put one, three in two. P is equal to P naught plus rho 
by 2 v1 square is how much 2 gh rho by 2 we don't know v no but v i what i can write it as v1 by r1 r all square i think better write one more equation no p equal to p not plus rho rho by 2 will come outside v1 square also outside 1 minus r1 square by r square now what is v1 2g h the expression for p will be p not plus rho g h 1 minus r r1 square it's there this problem is there from edo i just picked up from there uh, this equation of continuity is what will trouble there's a new thing is what we are having i think uh, so you you must be able to analyze the disk the this is circular disk of radius r2 of radius say like a r and will have a speed v like this then then what happen the same circular this will become radius r1 will have a speed v1 okay are, are able to think this one so what is the area of uh, area of equation of continuity 2 pi r d into v1 and the equation of continuity is what will trouble you Rest of everything you can manage. 